Hey, what's up, everybody? So I just finished listening to Chloe Bailey's and Chris Brown's newest single, How Does It Feel? Um, cute track, core R&B track, uh, definitely radio friendly, definitely can hear it on the urban R&B um, radio stations. Um, the first thing that I re uh, recognized from the song was the track. The track was a sample from Usher's Rollback song, which was on his iconic Confessions album. So when I heard the track, I said, this is some heavy shoes to fill. So I was just wondering how it was all going to just play out. So it starts off with the, the hook, um, Chloe's on the hook. It's a slow, flowy, kind of legato, legato uh, type of hook. Um, and then Chris Brown starts the first verse and he changes the melody. It's a faster melody, kind of rappy, singy type of vibe, which I enjoyed because it showed some contrast from the slow hook. Um, so Chris Brown does the first verse. It goes to the uh, um, pre-chorus B section and then back to the um, hook with Chloe. Again, slower melody and then Chloe introduced the second uh, verse. Um, I was hoping that she would have adopted the same melody as Chris on the first to show some contrast, but she went with a slower uh, melody on the second verse. And I felt like the, it brought, that brought the song down just a little bit for me. I wish she would have stayed up because the hook is already slow, um, just for layers and just for contrast. But yeah, so she does the second verse. It goes again back to the pre-chorus and it out with the hook. Um, overall, good, good song. Uh, it makes you it makes you want to bop your head, you know. Definitely, it's gonna definitely be put, played in heavy rotation on R and B uh, radio. Definitely, without a doubt. Um, I just expected probably a stronger um, single, given the sample from Usher and given the feature from Chris Brown. Um, well, I do like the single. I w was expecting a little, something a little bit more stronger. You know, but definitely going to rule, I feel like, the R&B charts. And um, I'm looking forward to see what she does on this album. All right, J.R. Thomas, above the note.